lot of my uh, spirited runs, as everybody knows, are all basically in Southern California, in and around the mountain roads within a two, 300 mile range of downtown LA. You know, and generally all, that whole environment is high desert, dry, arid. Here in uh, Raleigh, North Carolina, everything's undulating. Everything is amazingly lush and green. You know, we're here in uh, mid-October. The leaves are starting to change. And it's, it's one of those, you know, being out in California for so long in Southern California, you really lose track of time because it is somewhat of a seasonless environment where it's pretty much the sun shines most of the time. So you don't, there's not a really tremendous amount of difference whether you go for a drive in February or you go for a drive in September. You know, maybe it's a little bit hotter, but the environment is the same. The landscape is the same. It's been a long, long time since I've been in a green, lush environment driving a car. You know, it's just amazing how green it is here. Basically, I'm on what I like to call my Southern Charm and Hospitality road trip, where for the first time I'm actually uh, driving my favorite 1971 911T, car number 277, uh, on some uh, really exciting, fresh new roads in a new environment that I've uh, never driven on before. actually got to drive uh, my favorite car, number 277 on VIR, which I believe is a uh, 1.6 mile tight twisty track. And it was just great to experience a, uh, a different track in a different environment. The majority of tracks that I've driven, they're all essentially tracks that are out in the desert, the high desert, dry and dusty environment. VIR is the complete opposite. It's in a completely tranquil setting, very lush, rolling hillside, and the track is phenomenal. I'm also here to, ex uh, to attend the um, first time of the North Carolina Museum of Art Porsche by Design Seducing Speed event. I've never seen Porsches in a museum. You know, the last car I saw in a museum, uh, ironically, was an E-Type Jag, and that was in London. I think having an environment like the North Carolina Museum of Art, where uh, Porsche was on hand to display a lot of their historic uh, cars, enabled people like myself that don't really visit museums to actually see a an environment that is not a traditional museum environment. Obviously, I often talk about Porsche is its own design aesthetic, especially the 911, an iconic car that's uh, really not changed much of its DNA in 50 years. And it was just like the perfect setting of car design in an art museum. It's not very often I drive this car in the rain. It's been slightly drizzly and damp all day. I actually bolted on a set of uh, windshield wipers that I happen to have in the uh, trunk of my car. So uh, just been a great, great change of pace. I'm so glad that I'm here with my car as opposed to driving around in a rental car. Just to be at one with my favorite car on these open roads, which are new to me. And just the whole sort of landscape of old, old buildings that you see, these great old sort of decaying farmhouses and barns that some are abandoned and there seems to be a lake on every property. You know, it's just a really different landscape that is fresh and exciting. It's a landscape that you don't see in California, or at least in Southern California. So uh, that's the great thing about North Carolina. It's really just a great place to be.